When you at six tonight, Florida residents are either evacuating or preparing for impacts as Hurricane Milton makes its way to Florida now as a category five hurricane once again. Good evening and thank you so much for joining us here on CBS 19 News at 6. I'm Jesus Martinez and despite the distance, East Texans are doing what they can to help. CBS 19 Savannah Hale spoke with a couple who are using their resources to help those affected by Helene and are now preparing to help after Milton. Clothes, medical supplies, chainsaws. chainsaws. Just over a week ago, Ryan and Claire Hall made a post on social media asking for donations for flood victims in North Carolina. Ever since, they've been collecting at their business all natural stone and grass. We just posted, hey, we're going to donate some water, get some water, and then all of a sudden the ball just started rolling. And then people started contacting us and what can we do? It yeah. exploded quickly. Yeah. Using their own trucks and forklifts from their business, the Halls are preparing to deliver their second load to North Carolina, which will be over 50 tons of various supplies delivered. Camping stuff, shovels, blankets, Russ Volunteer Fire Department. They donated a fire truck, uh, which is a water truck, 3,000 gallon water truck, because they don't have any potable water room there. They're calling what they're doing Operation We the People. We're not here to say, you know, red state, blue state, any of that stuff. It's a, it's a state of disaster. So right now it's just time to get in there and get these people some, what they need. And they're not planning to stop anytime soon. When I asked them how many more loads they planned on taking to affected areas. How many more loads would y'all take up there? As many as we need. Till we're out. Till, 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 till they say stop. They didn't expect so much support, but they're thankful because now they can continue to help make a difference. Just the outpouring of people in the community and just not just in East Texas, but all over the United States has just been a blessing. I just think it's been really neat seeing people from all over the world come together and help people who they don't even know they lost everything without any warning. Yeah. And there's been so many selfless acts of people just jumping in and doing what's needed without even needing to be asked for. For CBS 19. Yeah, we're going to North Carolina. I'm Savannah Hale. And as you heard there just a few hours ago, the Halls took those supplies to North Carolina. And when they return, they'll bring more loads in for the affected victims by Hurricane Milton. And if you'd like to make a donation, you can find more information on our website, CBS19.tv.